Like, why y'all in my face? Like, mm -mm. But good morning, you guys. <laughs> How do people wake up, like, and vlog? Like, this is so, like, raw. <laughs> but it is 5.30, you guys. And... My alarm goes off at 5 o'clock for me to get up. And I've been sitting in this bed trying to decide, do I want to get up? Do I want to go to the gym? Do I want to do the things that I continue to tell myself that I want to do? Like, oh, we're going to change. We're going to make changes. Every morning, I do this vicious cycle. Like, I get up at 5. I sit here. Sometimes I just hit snooze. I don't even, like, officially wake up. But... For the most part, I don't get up. I do this every morning. And I say, we'll try again next morning. We'll try again tomorrow. Today's excuse is my stomach is cramping. I mean, it really is cramping. It cramps so bad, but I keep it in snooze. It's like, I want better, but I don't feel like doing better. Like, what is that? I feel like I should keep these moments to myself and I shouldn't even express or tell anybody this, but I just really have these days where I just can't figure it out. Like, I just cannot figure out why I can't do the things that I want to do for myself. Like, I don't get it. Like, how do you say you want something and you know what's required to do it, but you continue to not do it? I don't know. Maybe I can help me out. So I decided to do something. <sighs> Sorry. Put my morning breath all in y'all face. I don't know y'all this is just morning talks I don't know I guess I'll turn on the camera when I officially wake up all right I'm up I'm up I'm up I'm up sheesh <laughs> it's like I can hear y'all in the comments like get up girl get up just you got this I'm up. I'm up. All right, your girl is looking a little bit better. I brushed my teeth. I put a little ponytail in my hair. Y'all, I did this little, my drop, my lips are so dry. I did this, like, I arched my eyebrows the other day. And now I got this, like, big ingrown hair or pimple or something in there like i don't know what it is it's like something new in my face every day like i'm so over it but anyway we're about to go make her coffee figure out what the hell we're gonna wear and i figured today i can just do like a get ready with me video like go do my makeup and just like make this like a true get ready with me type video um there's this outfit that i've been wanting to wear but I just don't know how to wear it. <laughs> but I'm thinking maybe just this. I'm thinking I might just wear this. That might be a cute outfit. I gotta re I don't feel like re ironing anything either. I think this would be cute. I'm trying to do like a um a reel, and I kinda wanna do like corporate baddie i saw this girl on tiktok and she does like this corporate baddie videos which is so cute and i think this would kind of fit like it's cute cash like work appropriate i don't know this might be today's vibe we'll see y'all cotton candy sweet and roll let me see that just roll oh just roll just 
steep to steep to zero. Y'all, how did we get here? How did we get here? It is eight o'clock. So I tried to do my makeup off camera because I realized I was running out of, out of time. So I did most of my makeup off camera. And then I was like, I'm gonna just come back for like the finishing touches so that I can talk to y'all a little bit because I had intentions on doing my whole face on camera but I know I wasn't gonna have enough time and I'm using my vlogging camera and it was gonna overheat and yada 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 so yeah anyway I probably only have like 12 minutes of conversation anyway so it don't even matter it don't it don't even matter but anyway um your girl know how to pronounce the liquor thanks to unique because she left it in the comments I already figured she was gonna leave it in the comments like I could have googled it like I said and I forgot so I was like I know unique is gonna come through and she did period I won't be out here saying DiGiorno pizza okay thank you so anyway she also left a comment that was talking about like friendships and just knowing exactly what you want as far as like making friends and uh, my whole little dilemma with like friends here and yeah, I'm so annoying like I'm so annoying when it comes to this like one minute I want to make like real connections genuine connection with people and then on the flip side I'm like no I don't want to make no type of connection with nobody because it requires you to do too much like friends still require you to put too much effort and time into it and i'm like do i genuinely have the time do i have the mental to want to invest in another person i be having moments where i'm like you know what maybe i just don't even want to be a friend either like mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. i just want to have fun i just want to have a good time i just want to vibe that's just the vibe I'm on. I just want to have a good time, have fun, stress free. Like life is too short. Like I had like this whole year, this whole year I've been depressed, Darnisha, and stressed. The rest of this year is about to be a vibe. It's about to be stress motherfucking me free. <laughs> I'm definitely not about to stress about a bitch ain't mine. It's like, if you ain't my bitch, then I'm not about to stress. And if that's what's going to happen in a friendship, I don't want it. <laughs> I don't want it. I just want to have fun. And it's like, oh, can we just have fun? So, yeah, that is just kind of my take on friendships at this moment. Like, I just want a genuine friendship, you know, like a friendship that... You know, we don't, we talk, but we don't need to talk all the time. There's no pressure if we don't talk. Anyway, off the friendship topic, you guys, outside of that, work has been freaking crazy. Um, it is so crazy. So I didn't really talk about it in my last video, but I kind of touched on it a little bit. So y'all know that we are new adjusters and there was already adjusters there and i think i might have talked about how many claims that they've had so their workload they're like up to like 200 to 300 claims some of them are at 300 claims because they genuinely just don't do their job but some people are at a max number because you get a lot of claims and they were short staff now back in october they hired like a group of people and in this group of people the company thought it was a good idea to take claims from the other adjusters, the older ones, and give to the new adjusters. So they gave them like 80 claims on top of their workload that they was already getting. And they're still new adjusters and not knowing what's going on. And they just kind of got thrown in this shit, shit show. And now they're stacked up just as high as the older adjuster so everybody is working so hard so we came in as the newer adjusters and they told us they wasn't gonna do that to us they were like oh you know we're gonna lie like I don't understand why people just don't tell the truth 
of what it is up front just let me know what it is like don't tell me one thing and then it turns out to be something else like that's how fucking confusion happens that's how like just communicate like i don't understand why it's so hard for people to communicate things and what they really want just say what you want tell us that we gonna get fucking claims <laughs> and they didn't do that and now we got claims that we shouldn't have had they did the same thing to us not as many but they did the same thing to us that they did to these older adjusters and now i'm kind of like trying to tread freaking water and every time i get to work i'm like oh my gosh i'm so over this day and i don't get shit done <laughs> i don't get shit done because your girl be stressed out so yeah it's 8 13 i really don't have time my camera's already hot and she's been talking for 13 minutes like the fuck? i'll be big okay y'all so i'm thinking i'm liking this so i was trying to decide because i the first time i wore this shirt i wore it with blue jeans but today i'm thinking to do black and then i'm putting on a bodysuit to kind of make it I don't know what I'm trying to make it. Freaking strings, whatever the hell they were, were just annoying the shit out of me. But um, I don't really know how I want to tie it. So I think I'm gonna tie it like this. I think that's that's cute. Just like maybe just do like a little knot and tuck it like that. I feel like that's cute. What y'all think? Cute. well that is gonna be it and then i'm gonna use my fresh mochino this is like probably one of the first scents i bought and it's kind of neat in a, a real okay we are back downstairs in the office it's 8 30 so we're still doing very good on time kind of um and then I forgot I was actually making a little, what is it called? I was trying to make a little reel because I want to do the sticky song so bad. But, um, I'm doing bad, so. I don't know why on Instagram I have to use a filter for everything. Like, I just have to use a filter. Like, I don't know. It's just so cute. But on my camera, like, there's a filter on here, but I've never used that filter. I had it on accident one time, and I was like, ew. Like, I just did not like how I look. Like, ew. But on Instagram, like, <laughs> I use a filter for everything. Like, girl, make it make sense. Okay. I think I like that little clip right there. And then, uh, I th yesterday I did a lip gloss and it was kind of cute. So I think I'm gonna do that again. And then I need to do my highlight. And then lip gloss or lipstick. We really don't have time. We don't have time. Pick something and call it a day, girl. Peeky, 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 peek, 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 peek. I really think I'm gonna do like a brown lip. I thought I was gonna um just do like a get ready with me, but I realized that this is not enough footage. I don't think it's enough, so I just guess I'm gonna have to continue to vlog for the day. This is so sticky. This is not even giving me what I wanted. All right, let's go get our energy drink, clock in for the day, and let's let's put in some work. 
So these are the shoes that I wore the other night. So I'm just gonna keep these on. So this is the full outfit. Yeah, I think I like it. She's giving, not corporate batting. She's giving, I don't know what she's giving, but this is it, okay. Look at my plant, it's doing so good. Like, oh, she is so beautiful. But anyway, we are clocked in and ready to go. I actually have to be in a queue, which is like taking calls for like first notice of law. So any accidents that occurred today, yesterday, whenever they whenever they occurred, um, we have to take the calls. So that's what I'm about to do within the next two minutes, which is kind of throwing me off schedule to be honest because I forgot about it whenever I be trying to come to work I be like oh I'm about to do this and something be throwing me off so we're gonna take some calls Darnisha in the claims department on a recorded line how can I help you you said you need to see if it has an existing claim okay what's the policy number And what's the name of the insured? And what's the date of loss? Okay, let me go ahead and give you that claim number. 943. She left for work, right? Okay. And then the adjuster is Karen. Look who picked up this camera again and vlog i'm so proud of myself you know we day two in this thing and your girl feel like we doing it <laughs> we doing it so i just went and got me a pizza from borrows i've been doing so well i've been doing kind of good like i've been eating kind of healthy because y'all know we about to go to the gym like the gym we about to do it you know today was a baby step we got up and we 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 had a struggle but tomorrow <laughs> tomorrow we're gonna get it together because tomorrow we don't have to do no we're not tomorrow we're not doing our makeup or anything so we're just gonna knock out the gym and then we're gonna beast out this month like <laughs> but anyway anyway today at work is going pretty good like i'm trying to knock out my claims i'm still trying to figure out my flow and my process and like how i want to do things but for the most part it's going so yeah i'm excited about that the day is like halfway over i feel like by the time i get off of lunch like i got like three more hours so i gotta try to get a lot done in three more hours but it is what it is but for the most part i just wanted to check in with y'all let y'all know how my day was going and I'm going to see y'all once I officially get off of work. I'm about to enjoy my pizza because I'm not supposed to be eating anyway. So I'm going to just go ahead and enjoy this pizza. Let me be great. And we're going to watch some YouTube. And enjoy this hour of relaxation. Okay? Period. All right, you guys, the girl is oily. I'm a little tipsy, I got a little buzz. Made me a few shots, okay. Made this meal that's leaking all over the place. Yeah, I'm trying to check Aisha food. So I'm obsessed with this grits and greens. Like, it's so good to me. Guess, guess, guess who's busy? Guess, 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 guess. I'm so freaking oily, y'all. But I just came back to end this video properly. Like, I was trying to tell y'all this whole little thing because I was so excited. But I'm going to tell y'all tomorrow. So, just stay tuned for tomorrow's vlog. See y'all tomorrow.